In this video, I will demonstrate the compensation of the ball probe on the ferroarm quantum. To begin, we're going to select P on the keyboard, and that will launch the device control panel within the software. Within the next screen, select the probe that you want to compensate. Next, select Hole Compensation. And the next dialog box will show you step-by-step -step instructions on the compensation process, as well as a graphic display of the rotation of the arm as you're compensating the probe. Select Start Compensation, and let's begin. So I'm going to bring the probe down towards the compensation cone. We're going to want to use the compensation cone that's included in your probe kit. And you see I have mine mounted to the same surface as the base of the arm. We also want to ensure that it's about two-thirds the reach of the arm away from the base of the arm to allow for proper rotation as we're compensating the probe. So let's rest the ball inside the cone. And this last axis, we want to start with it in the vertical position. To capture the first set of points, we're going to press and hold the green button and pivot down into each of the three cuts in this compensation cone. So let's begin. Press and hold the green button. Pivot down into the first cut, release the button, come back up to vertical, and repeat the process in the next two cuts. Press and hold. Release, come back up to vertical, and one more time, press and hold. Release, come back to vertical, and now we're ready to transition to the last step in the process. To do that, we're going to press the red button on the arm, and that'll change your instruction screen as well. So you'll see instructions for the next step in the process, and for that, we're going to press and hold the green button and rotate this last axis of the arm through a comfortable range of motion of your wrist. So let's just press and hold the green button, rotate, release the button, and select the red button to end the command. The results of your compensation will appear on the screen, and if these are acceptable to you, select Save and Exit, and we're ready to measure.